Gui! Gui! Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei. Now listen up, man. I done found two glitches in the matrix, my boy. First, I'm going to be showing y'all my main build that I'm going to be ISOing with on the 3v3s. Second, I'm going to be showing y'all a build that is the best play shot on the 2v2s. Both. Okay, so look. The first build I'm showing you is for 3v3, pro-am, stage, etc., all that. The second 3v3 stage and the second build I'm showing you is for 2v2s right I believe I see a lot of y'all making play shots with lock take and like no finishing and no close shot and all that I don't fuck with it but I have a better version where you're basically a lock without lock take so I just think it's better overall and you're gonna be able to shoot way better so yeah I don't know I think this is way better for most people and me personally but yeah especially after playing this game and learning that paint is buffed and fancy footwork is gone and paints buffed like how you gonna finish with like no badges you and especially when everyone gets to their defensive badges you feel me uh, you know but hey i got y'all bro and no close shot so look this is the first build make sure y'all watch this full video no skips Hit up that like button if y'all want a dribble tutorial, my boy. And, yeah, turn on the noti. Subscribe if you new. 300K on the way. Help a young nigga grow. Make sure y'all hit that like button. It helps me getting recommended. I don't be asking for no reason. Hit the like button. Help your boy out if you fuck with me. And, yeah, let's get into it. So, make sure y'all look at both of these builds, bro. So, look, here's my first build. I'm not playing with Mike Wang this year, right? So look, you're going to go first physical because you want, you want as much speed as possible. You want as much speed as possible since you're a play shot, right? Okay, so this is the 3v3 build. Hold on. Look at that. Eight finishing, bro. Now look. Let, let, hold on. Let, 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 let me finish this guy. <laughs> let me finish this guy first. Okay, so look. You get eight more attributes after you get the, the perfect badge layout. And you could put that on free throw since it's going to be 64 type shit. You know, or if you're worried about your inside since you only have six badges, this is the 3v3 stage version. You could upgrade your interior. Me personally, I'm going to put it right here, right? I, 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 I ain't fucking with Mike Wayne this year, bro. Playmaking take don't work. None of the moves are working. I played on a playmaker with 30, 30 badges, right? Couldn't really get no stuns and nothing like nothing crazy, bro. Nobody falling. Man, I ain't playing with this nigga this year. I'm going OP. But look, so close shot, 82. Close shots are the little cheesy close shots under the midi, under the free throw, stuff like that, right? The reason you upgrade close shot is so you can get more finishing badges, right? Driving layup, dunk, post hook. You know, these are, are bailouts you could use. Now look, paint defense is buffed. Fancy footwork is nerfed, right? Not everyone even has their... Their defensive badges imagine imagine when they get them right and you're playing versus locks and you have no finishing and paint defense is buff how are you going to finish you're going to shoot every time especially if you're an iso player if you're ice one with a play shot i don't know i only think certain people could do it and then even then i think it's limiting to play with the build with no finishing if you play someone as good as you i think you're at an extreme advantage and you're going to struggle bro um 18 shooting is good enough because once you see the takeover we pick, you're gonna be OP as shit, my boy. You're gonna have Dan, you're gonna have a 99-3. Okay? A 99-3 speed boosting like a god, 21 playmaking fire, and six since defensive badges, guarding corner is good. And uh top of the key on the threes and, and all, all that shit, man. So look, 
you want to be versatile man make sure you pick burly it makes your player appear bigger so you're not going to be as little people aren't going to be trying you like that because they're going to think you're bigger and you're going to look 6'5 but you're 6'3 right we're going to go with 6'3 this is for the 3v3 the pro-am stuff more speed overall you're going to be quicker stuff like that we're going with 6'3 this year for 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 my 3v3 builds um I'm going with 6'3 this year. I don't, I don't give a fuck. I'm not playing with Mike Wayne this year. Now, for the for the weight, we're not going to go lowest. We are going to go 173. You get a little bit of weight on you, and you still get the, the same speed as if you were lowest weight. Okay? 173. Wingspan. We're bringing that bitch all the way down. Okay? So, you're going to have a... See, look, and also people be making three-point playmakers, but then your midi has to be super low. Nigga, once you finish this build at 99, you have a 99 midi. Do you want a 99 midi or do you want like an 80-something just so you can have a fancy name? Come on, my nigga, wake up. <laughs> uh, that name shit is lame. Now, look, three-point is going to be... A 95 people run floor general i'm gonna be running around with a 99 three because i'm always play with a lock that could put on floor general you you feel me uh, it's op my boy yeah that, that that's why i don't need all them finishing badges because i'm already gonna have a 99 three plus everything else that adds up so look we're gonna go sharp takeover playmaking takeover i'm not playing with it bro they he 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 won't buff it he keeps nerfing us playmakers, stamina ass, all that. Man, I'm going to be isoing, sharp take. I'm going fucking bananas, nigga. You feel me? I'm going sharp take this year. I'm not sharp take most OP, makes you look like a god. I'm going sharp take. I don't give a fuck, bro. Fuck all that ankle breaker shit. You can still do it. Like, I always went play for, for, for entertainment and all that but it, it wouldn't even help with the views so i'm just gonna go straight shooting i'm assassinate niggas i'm frying niggas straight comp swan you feel me now i'm finna show y'all the 2v2 build okay look playmaker shot creator damian lillard build <laughs> isn't that ironic so look test build i'm gonna show y'all the badges i would pick for this guy and then i'm gonna move on to the second build the best play shot for 2v2s man Make sure y'all hit up that like button, man. Turn on them post notices, my boy. Hey, make sure y'all follow me on Twitch, too. So, look. You have eight finishing badges, bro. Eight. Eight. Look. Look at this. You feel me? You feel me? <laughs> you feel me? You're a finisher now. You can finish. You can finish. You are not just a threat from three and midi. You can finish. You can dunk the ball. You can finish. This build is better than builds with one finishing, bro. Paint defense is buffed. I don't know what's wrong with people. And then maybe pro touch is buffed. You don't you don't know. Some, some of these can be buffed. Like Giant Slayer could be buffed. Relentless. Something, something else. There could be another glitch. And you, you got finishing on a build that's a God 3 build. A God 3 build, right? A God 3 build and can finish? Come on, man. Stop playing with me, bro. I, I think people just stupid. <laughs> now, look. You get all your badges. You could rock the volume shooter. Or you could rock the clutch shooter. Or the tireless shooter. Or the difficult shots until Mike Wang patches it watch my uh badge glitch video um i show information that shows he's going to get it patched make sure y'all watch my first part games they're hilarious too uh he's gonna patch because you know when you do a dribble moves and you shoot immediately you fade so this is why you might want to put difficult shots on silver until he fixes that and then you can upgrade clutch shooter or corner or whatever you want bro wait wait till y'all see the 2v2 build bro You know, you, you, you could rock something like this, bro. You feel me? Um, if Impluckable's better, you know, you could put it on Silver. Um, if it's better, better, you could put it on <clears throat> Hall of Fame. Have Bell out on Bronze. Um, gold last year was perfect to throw out of anything. Uh, we don't know which Ankle Breaker badge is the wave, but 
I, you know, I, I just got it like this. So you, you're going to be able to max out an ankle breaker badge or do double silver or something like that. This looks like a good uh, layout. You know, for 3v3, you know, you got clamps on silver, intimidator, rim protector, gold. They try to try you down low. You feel me? I, you know, I know I started this trend on the, on the PGs. Yeah, it helps a lot, man. You struggle down low, you a little PG, max rim protector, okay? The reason why, I mean, if you want to put bronze and then put something like that, you know, you can, but clamps personally, just so people don't try to baby you and all that. But I mean, this could be a better combo to stop down low paint shit, or you could just do this. I think this might work out better. And then um, maybe maybe this will be a wave to stop people from cutting and stuff. You never know. Now I'm going to show you all the second build, bro. Okay. Okay. I'm finna show you all the second build, my boy. We're going to go point guard. On point guard, you get an extra playmaking badge for play shots. You get an extra playmaking badge for shooting guard. You get like an extra 20 attributes. That's the difference. So do you think 20 attributes is better than one playmaking badge? Completely up to you, bro. <laughs> so look, we're going to go with this pie chart. This is the best play shot for 2v2, bro. Okay, we're going to go with the most speed. Okay, you need the most speed, right? Okay, now this is the best 2v2 play shot. You will see why. Keep watching. Don't skip. Now look. Eight badges is enough, my boy, even without lock take. I'm going to show you why, bro. So look, your close shot. What 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 are 2v2s? You're fading, you're shooting close shots, you're trying to outsmart the defense. If you have no close shot, you know, it's going to ruin you. Drive and lay up 80, you know, when someone comes down low and he has a certain attribute, you have a certain attribute, you know, it's going to help you. But either way, we did it for three finishing badges just so you can finish so you're not a, just a shooter and you play someone that's good they don't have to worry about you taking it because they can late come and make you miss that's dumb to me bro paint defense is buffed so you at least want to be able to have three finishing bro you know and and decent ratings and be able to fade close and stuff like that y'all upgrading no close shot i think that's an l bro um now the shooting once you see what we're going to do you're going to see why. This is perfect. You don't need those 22. This is perfect. Playmaking, perfect, bro. Now, you upgraded your interior. You're going to get stops, especially once you see the height and the wingspan. You could um do offensive rebound instead of block. But um I think block is would be better because now they added the gameplay where when you get blocks, that hole stays in bounds. So this will help you overall. You know, or you could go for offensive rebound. You ISO in, your guy shoots, he misses. You could get more boards. Personally, up to you. Um, I don't know which would be better between block and offensive rebound. So that's something you could change. And um, yeah, I would do this right here. But yeah, always make them burly. So you're going to look even taller than the height that is presented, bro. We're going to go 6'5. Okay. You can go 6'4. You know, it's a 2v2 build. Don't make them 6'3". You can go 6'5". Okay? This is why you, you, you're not going to need the lock take, bro. Um, you're going to eventually be able to, to do all the pro moves and stuff. You just got to grind your build, bro. Grind your build. You know? It, it's no problem, bro. But if you're worried about that, you don't have to go 6'5", right? But me personally, I, I grind out my builds to make them as good as possible. I mean, it, it's, it's up to you, bro. 6'5. We're not gonna go lowest weight. We're gonna go 178. That's how you keep your the highest speed and acceleration with a little bit of weight. Now the wingspan, right? Max that hoe. Okay. We maxing that hoe. So your ball handle is an 83. You upgrade them, you're gonna be able, and or if someone just runs uh you know, you, you man, if you upgrade them, you gonna eventually get 85, 85 some pro dribble moves, and and you good. It, it's it's not hard. Play on them a little bit. You don't. Do you really need to speed boost off rip, or do you want a better build overall? Now look, I know it lowers the three, 
And I know a lot of people be making three-point playmakers and all that other bullshit. But look, your midi is an 86, bro. With max wingspan. With max wingspan, bro. Four more, it's a 90. Don't make players for names, bro. You want to win, my boy. Your three points an 83. Then it's going to be an 87, right? Once you upgrade them to 99. Look, look at this, bro. Look at your block, bro. You're basically a lock. Look, 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 look at these stats, man. Upgrade your steel. You're going to get more steals. You know, you're going to get more steals. It's going to be harder for people to block you. All that, you know? So you're going to be able, you're going to look big. You're going to be able to finish easier, speed boosting. And guess what? And you get sharp take. We're going sharp take. Look. So look, look, look at this. So your speed's going to be a 97. Your acceleration's going to be a 96. Right? At 6'5", max wingspan. Speed boosting, doing all the moves, all the glitchy stuff. You basically have lock takeover. You don't need to make him a lock takeover. Now you get a scoring takeover that is the best takeover in the game. And you don't have to worry about your shooting because your sharp takeover keeps building up. This is the best 2v2 build. Spread it, my boy. I'm pretty sure no one made this. And then guess what? You get a unique name so people don't even know you're a play shot, my nigga. Niggas aren't even going to know you're a play shot. Look. Bam. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, my nigga. Look. Morient, Curry, Francis. Look. You feel me? Niggas aren't even going to know you're a play shot. You feel it? I'm telling you, bro. So look, you could do something like this, something like this. You know, just who who knows what whatever whatever's the best. But and you're six five. Come on, bro. Come on, man. I'm the build god. Difficult shot since it makes you fade when you do a dribble move. Mike Wang say you gonna patch that or volume shooter, bro. Up to you, man. Same same shit, bro. Same, same, same shit as last build. Now look, the defensive. Look at this. So you're gonna want clamps max, pick dodger max, rim protector. You know, so, something like this could work, man. Um, you could, you could put this on, uh, you know, something like this. Since you got your block up, be able to get a little bit of blocks. Something like this, bro. I think this is valid. I don't know if you'll need gold pick dodger this year, but um. Yeah, you're going to get a lot of stops, bro. Rim protector, max wingspan, 6'5". Come on, boy. You're going to get a lot of stops. People aren't going to be able to expect that you, like, a, a build, like, the that the, that shooting like a god is going to be able to have defense like this. You're going to catch him completely off guard, bro. 6'5", max wingspan, and then these badges, you basically a lock, my boy. Thank me later, man. Make sure, anywho... That's the end of the video. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new. Hit that like button. It's greatly appreciated. Helps my channel out. Turn on post notes, man. I got a lot more coming. How to shoot, dribble moves, all types of shit, man. I'm, I'm going to put y'all on this year, man. Make sure y'all sub to my second channel. All my raids, Todgers will be on there. And I'm out this hole, man. I hope y'all niggas have a beautiful day. Drink a gallon of water a day.